Your customers have different tastes, and it's easy to customize their orders in Sapat. Use modifiers to add extra items or ingredients to their orders. Let's start. Click the menu button and choose Setup. Next, click Menu Setup. Choose the menu item that you want to add a modifier for, then click Edit. Scroll down to New Item Modifiers. Click Add Group to add a group modifier, then type its name. For mandatory modifiers, set the minimum to 1. For optional modifiers, set the minimum to 0. Set the maximum number of modifiers they can have. In this case, let's do 50. If you want your customers to be able to order more than one unit for each item modifier, select Add Multiple Quantity. Click OK. Now we need to add the item modifiers to the group. If applicable, also add an additional price. For this menu item, we will add these modifiers. Beef patty with an additional price of $5, cheese with an additional price of $0.50, cents, lettuce with an additional price of $0.10, cents, pickles with no additional cost, tomato with no additional cost, and onion with no additional cost. Click Save Template so you can use the same template in the future. Enter the name of the template and click Save. If you decide to use this on your other menu items, click Load Template and select. When done, click Update. Don't forget to click Refresh POS menu to reflect the changes in your POS. Let's check out the added modifiers in the POS. Click Walk-in. Your customer wants to order from the main course category. To access the modifiers, Click the leaf icon next to the item and click Modifiers. Your customer wants a beef burger with two extra slices of cheese and extra pickles. $15 for all of it. And you're done! Remember these three simple steps to add modifiers in your menu item. Edit the menu item, add the group modifier, and finally, enter your item modifiers. Want to learn more? Click on the link below to book a demo.